Hello truth seekers and welcome back to our channel, where we unveil the shocking truth behind the glamorous world of Prince Harry and Meghan Markle. Ladies and gentlemen, welcome back to our channel. We're back here again with another dose of reality about the ongoing saga of gold digger Harry and Meghan. Today we're diving headfirst into the latest bombshell surrounding Meghan and Harry's disgusting plot against the royal family. Strap yourselves in, because this is going to be a wild ride. But before we delve into the tumultuous waters of this revelation, if you haven't already, do me a favor and hit that subscribe button and turn on notifications. You won't want to miss the explosive content we have in store. So now what's the latest drama? Well, hold on to your seats because it's a doozy. Meghan Markle, the mastermind behind this whole debacle, has just canceled a trip for her fake kids, Archie and Lily, to the UK after King Charles's plea. That's right, folks, you heard me correctly. Fake kids are sick again. According to royal experts, Meghan is unlikely to bring Archie and Lilibet to the United Kingdom despite sources claiming that King Charles is desperate to see his grandchildren. Now isn't that just the epitome of selfishness? The relationship between Meghan, Harry, and the royal family has been strained, to say the least. And instead of trying to mend bridges, Meghan is doubling down on her selfishness by denying her children the chance to spend some time with their extended family. Shameful, isn't it? But wait, it gets even worse. King Charles reportedly extended an invitation to the Sussexes to spend the summer in Balmoral in an attempt to reconcile. But royal commentator Charlotte Griffiths doubts Meghan will accept the offer. Can you believe it? She's turned down an olive branch from the future king. Charlotte speculated that Meghan wouldn't be interested in a rural royal life at Balmoral, citing her supposed disdain for cold two bar radiators and boot rooms. Oh, give me a break. Meghan's excuses are as transparent as glass. And here's the kicker. Harry and Meghan made the decision to step back from their royal duties in 2020, claiming they wanted a quieter life away from the spotlight. Yet here they are still trying to milk their royal connections for all they're worth. Their children, Archie and Lilibet, have barely spent any time in the UK, despite Meghan's claims that she wants them to have a relationship with their royal relatives. It's all smoke and mirrors, folks. Meghan and Harry are playing a dangerous game, using their kids as pawns in their quest for fame and fortune. And let's not forget about Harry. He's just as complicit in this whole mess as Meghan is. While he may not be the mastermind behind their plot, he's certainly playing the role of puppet to perfection. Sure, he's due to return to the UK next month for the 10th anniversary of the Invictus Games, but that doesn't excuse his behavior. He's still allowing Meghan to call the shots, even when it means depriving his own children of the chance to spend time with their family. It's time for Meghan and Harry to wake up and smell the roses. The world is on to their game and we're not buying it anymore. They can't hide behind their fake smiles and their fake excuses forever. So, what do you think about this, guys? Sound off in the comments and let me know what you think. Until then, stay tuned for more shocking stories and scandalous exposés on our YouTube channel. Remember to like, share, and subscribe to stay updated on the latest from the world of the royal family. Thanks for watching. We'll see you again with some more fascinating news about the royal family. Bye for now.